So, motherboards are quite compact things. Now, years ago, in your expansion slots, uh, each expansion device would be classed as a single slot expansion device, being a graphics card, or a network card, or a sound card. And these days, graphics cards are getting bigger and bigger and bigger. And we find ourselves in a situation now where you can buy a graphics card and it's a three slot card. So all the expansion slots have been covered up by the graphics card and you cannot use your expansion slots anymore. So what, what can you do if you want to use a network card or if you want to use a sound card? Well, there is a workaround. So as we can see here, this solid state drive has a cooler fitted on top and the people that make the uh, SSD know that the cooler can be so high whereby it will not touch a an expanded device such as um, a sound card or a graphics card they know that if you put a graphics card in it will sit directly over this and just by a smidgen not touch it the difference between the slot and the height of the cooler is five millimeters which means that say if you was fortunate to be able to use one of these ex these uh, PCI Express slots you would only have six, milli milli six millimeters of clearance so if you've got a three slot graphics card how can you use those slots. What you need, and I have one here, as you can see, as the PCI Express <coughs> connector, and via a ribbon is a PCI Express slot. So what shall we call this? I think we'll call it a PCI Express times one ribbon expansion slot right we're going to put that in now and then we're going to see if we can put the graphics card in oh by the way uh, this particular one I got has um, five millimeters length I mean five centimeters length which is like from here to over here and we're going to be putting this so the occupies this space here where there could have been another PCI Express times one slot just here but obviously the motherboard makers have filled it in with other gubbins but we're going to be expanding from there to there so we can use this In fact, it will be easier, I'm sure, if I put in my device first. So we'll put in the sound card, in this case. Then, we'll slot it in to the expansion. Oops. There we are, it's in. Then what I'm going to do is, I'm going to raise this card a little bit with a spacer which I've made out of wood so that the sound card which I've put in doesn't touch the motherboard and has a little bit of breathing space then I found myself an extra long screw which just so happens to fit I put that in it there for now then I'll get my three slot graphics card that 
that's in. And there, we can now see that we've got the sound card now working via the expansion that we've just used. And we have the three slot sound card. Winning trick.